Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm doing a tank review on the Panzer 48 today on these two guns, the 105 and the 75. Now, both of them are competitive at the teal, just both are used differently. You want to use the 75 mostly, in my opinion, but if Matsumeko starts to be like Matsumeko and it's putting your bottom tail, you'd want to use the 105 HC to do more reliable damage, at least 100 or something, like your Pan and Misty 75. Now, of course, you can't fire heats if you really want to on. Um, 105 it has 104 lumens of penetration not that much but 350 alphas are pretty good but for just overall trying to play the tank I really recommend the 75 even though the 105 is the last gun and <laughs> the 75 is the first gun you unlock That would a better one in my opinion. Now I have no equipment, standard consumables, and just AP. I will be getting <laughs> premium time back. I wanted to see what it's like without premium time. And let me tell you, it is a big difference. It's a lot harder without premium time. Way more stressful and all that. The armor, it's okay for its tail. It's 80. Not the best. It still has that weak Panzer IV torch you gotta look out for, and a giant controller on top of that. Here's the overall stats. Everything. Reload. Now, of course, if you're trying to get to the Panzer IV eights and everything, you have to go through the Panzer IV A, the Panzer IV D, Panzer IV eights, VK thirty, Tiger P, and the VK. Now, I've done the tank reviews and all of these already. Personally, I like this tank. I like this one. I did struggle a little with this one. But if you're curious on why I struggled with this one, or why I like the others, watch my tank reviews if you have the time. So that being said, let's get into some gameplay. Now, here we are in battle, guards and all that. I'm not doing three quarter things in guards, that's actually me talking in game set. If you prefer it like that, let me know. That being said, I am using the 105 in this clip. Now, both clips are took in until 5. Lucky shot there. I really didn't feel like taking the 300 that guy might have put into me. So I kind of took a snapshot there. Now the 105, like I said, words, it's HC is useful. If you struggle at aiming for weak points, or if you just always find yourself bottom two, you use this. One, because you don't have to aim. Two, because you do constant damage, even if you can't pass. Now you see, I'm seeing this guy in the front of his hull, which is supposed to be a 120 millimeter stick. And I'm still doing over 100 damage to him. It's like 6.9 second reload. Now, 
I do have a good commando, so that reload is down a little. But I don't have equipment. Now, if you want to put equipment onto this, I'm pretty sure 105 would be even more competitive. Because you can't get the 75s reload down much further with equipment because this reload is already pretty low. Plus, longer reloads benefit more from gun ammo and stuff like that. Missed that, so accuracy at long range is the best for it. But at the same time, you can still hit them. It just takes a while for yourself to get there. Because you're practically lobbing the cells towards them. Now, both gameplays of this is going to be tier 5, so yeah, the 75 is going to have an advantage. I know, like I said, in Gwads. Now, f both gameplays are in tier 7. They both be pretty slow, not very interesting, not much damage, but the 105 would be better in that kind of match maker. But I don't want to bore you guys to death and just have a sniping game at the back of the map, away from the front and everything. Now, the last time you tank drowns himself there, ain't of the same. I might have been able to find him and kill him. But it's not to be. We come third. There's the end screen. There's the difference between premium and not. I didn't get a thousand XP. I got less silver. But, next split. Now, if you are diabetic, I do apologize for this. Um, there are all two people in game set this game. As, okay, here we go. I'm sorry about this, if you're diabetic. Now I have a couple of friends that are diabetic, so I'm really not the best on this. The reason why my game set was on was because I was doing the live thing in Gwads. The tank review and all that. The problem oh, was is I forgot to turn it off afterwards. Uh, do a better job on that in the future. Now I had some fun with him with my uh, editing. I've <laughs> been reading that and laughing. Glad you're not taking it super serious. Yeah. But the diabetics is not something to be joking around about. These are just a couple of hillbillies having a good time. No, they're probably not being serious. So. Try not to go crazy with some or anything. Don't worry too much about it. Whoa, 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 because whoa, whoa, in the next. Whoa, whoa, don't keep driving. Don't keep driving. You're gonna fall off the fucking bridge. Because in the next. Good save. Good save. Good save. Good fucking save. Now in the next video, I will have audio turned off now. Uh, I wish I could ignore them here, but I'm trying to do commentary. The two of them are talking, it's making it pretty hard. 
So we're both suffering. Now uh, I'm. S yeah, I'll pawn it off after this, guys. I will do a better job in the future. Make sure we don't have to deal with people in game tracks. But if you like what I did in Gwads and the way I wasn't watching everything, let me know. Sadly, that tank destroyer pens me for sweet, <laughs> sweet force in my health. Now, I pushed to this aggressive spot to try to defend the base. Kinda, what I was hoping for was my teammates to come around and support me. But instead, they all, you know, died on the bridge, or sent everybody up to a hero to kill one too. <laughs> Now I do get a little bit of support there that helped me finish off that M4. I die. Cut to the end here. Moto gets him right there. End game credits are coming up. You got the on the side, open your eyes. I make it second place even though in a uh, losing ah, battle. Fuck him, still a defeat. I gotta get it in and gotta run that shit back. Now, as you can see, the 75 is a much more competitive gun at kill 5. And it's what I yeah, before. With all that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed and talk to you in the next one. See ya.